All right, people, welcome back to some more Rhyme and Why. So today is Friday, and that means that we are using Super Vice Bell. Super tired, super tired. I, I don't know, my sleep, my sleep schedule is just all fucked up, all fucked up. You know, I, I end up taking longer naps than usual, then waking up later in the night, not going to bed till later, waking up later. It's just, it's just bad. It's terrible. You know. You see, I'd be like, oh, you know, let me go ahead. It's like four o'clock. Take a nap. Wake up at six, and you know, be good until it's time to go. We go to bed, right? Nah, nah. Fucking my ass. I'm like, oh, take a nap at four. Wake up at eight. Stay up till like two in the morning. Wake up and like, like, not even nearly enough sleep. It's like it's just terrible, terrible. So of course we still gotta play the goddamn Mystic Tomato. Like I said, when it comes to like. Real life build decks, I probably won't even work on it or make it in real life. Uh, just until Wall Train gets them banned. Like, I'm still just way too shaky, way too inconsistent, and just doesn't look like I'll be using this deck much. But uh, I don't mind going doing the Mystic Tomato play just because uh, he either kills my battle and I get the summon, or he uses resources to get rid of it through other means. You know, either or I'm sitting okay. So. Uh, and just poke you for 14 since you don't want to play anything. You know, if you want to go ahead and use a mirror force or something on my Mr. Tomato, hey, more power to you. That's a, that's a mirror, that's another mirror force I don't have to worry about. I guess I'll go ahead and play this in deck then. Going against this circuit mysterious butt stabber over here, but yeah. Let's see, yeah, I think I went to, went, took a nap before, woke up at 8. Then I didn't go to sleep until like 2. Woke up at 8. Yeah, in the morning. And then I was getting ready to go ahead and do my recordings and shit, and I was like, nope, 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 still tired, still tired. So I went back to sleep, woke up at 11, and uh, yeah, I didn't have this video recorded yet. So uh, it's now 11, 12, and I literally have less than an hour to go ahead, record, render, upload this video, just like yesterday. Great. Drew Dimshaman. It's not terrible, I guess. It's only terrible that he hits me with like some kind of background or something. Hmm. Well, the question is, do I want to go ahead and pitch Doom Shaman Special Summon? Just to make sure that even if he bottomless his rentals or whatever, I still get Doom Shaman in the grave. I think that might be best. I think it might be best just to go ahead and Special Summon. So even if he hits me with back row, I at least got Doom Shaman in the graveyard. Because that, that, Doom Shaman's the important one. Uh, and you know what? Since I already got him here, let's go ahead and just pitch Summon again tonight. And, you know, it sucks, you know, it'd be awesome if I could just, like, see into the wall chain and also send you Bell slash Tinker and then be set up. But, of course, <sighs> I miss Chain. I miss Chain. I thought, I thought I'd be okay with it being banned, but I, just, I, I thought I would. But it just made me so much slower. Like, hopefully it's just the world thing that maybe they're just like, you know what? Hmm, not sure at this point if I want to send... I'll, I'll send you Bell. And hopefully it's just a world thing that they'll just be like, you know what, we don't want chain for worlds, let's go ahead and move it up. My opponent is not dueling me, like, at all. At all. You know, so, I, so pretty much I have a lot of things to do today. I have to, uh, go ahead and record, uh, this, of course. Wow, wow, I don't even know what my opponent was dueling, playing, or whatever, but wow. Just garbage hands. You know, and tomato, it helps with the sending, but it's kind of slow, you know, it's not even a decent draw at the, at, like, near the end of the game. The duels, just, mm, you know, I think this is the only UL deck that I'm still running uh, Summoner Monkey in, just because there's so many spells, and I don't, you know, I don't want to just be, a, you know, straight up dead draw, you know, there's so many spells that I can just go ahead and just be like, fuck it, pitch it. Tomato is good first turn, but it's just so slow second turn. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. Wow. 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 Just an ass. And this hand is the exact same, except for the fact that instead of Oasis, I got called Hunter. There goes some Tomato. We're going to get on again. And I Dark Record, the 1MST, the Supervised. Yeah, it's the exact same hand. Exact same fucking hand, so. 
I'll go and tell you. Now hold on to them, Mr. I don't know. I don't know. My opponent he just has a butt ton of back rows, so yeah. And I think, and of course, I think X Sabers. And knowing this guy, he's probably running the X Sabers. Like, oh, if you control X Saber, you can, you know, oh uh, yeah, stop your opponent's summon. So I think it's only inherent summons, though. Okay. Okay. So you're gonna do that during the damage step. Alright, so, yeah, I think it's Inherent Summons. Fat. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and drop Doom Shaman. And I guess I'll go ahead and Rotus Search for Armageddon Knight, Summon you Bell. I mean, Summon you Bell. Summon Armageddon Knight, drop. So this duel is not looking good right now. Just because of all this background. Swing is swing is awesome. I still, it's still super icy. Still my favorite. Yeah, I I yeah I I even carry uh I even carried my uh, miscut freaking doom shaman in my wallet. <laughs> yeah, my one that's uh cut I carry it in my wallet, especially since I'm not using it in my Ebel deck right now because it's torn torn apart. So if I see, I'll have one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna pull one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So. Might as well try to push for the Axiton, and if he has his counter trap, then fuck it, I'm gonna get it anyway, so I might as well go ahead and, and get rid of it. But if he doesn't, then I get to wipe his field, so. Yeah, so if he has like a Phoenix Chain or something, I could at least, okay, he has a breakthrough skill, so. It's totally different. Uh huh. So what's to say? When it's coming from the show, it's such a great way. You can add one X over from your deck to your hand. Okay, this card gains 200 attack for each face up X over monster control. I said it's just, you just played so much fucking back rail, this duel is gonna be really difficult. Uh, that's fine. So did I think? Okay. I don't say it's way too late now. No, you had seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I have one, two, three, four, five, six. So, yeah, you would have got a ton. The question is, do I want to really want to kill him right now? No, you know what? I'm good. I'm good. I, I, I don't want to do anything right now. If he attacks me, then I'll go ahead and fucking run. Wait, there's no point in attacking me. He has higher attack than me. I keep on forgetting because it's not like equipped or anything. So, I might as well make you use that breakthrough skill. And you're at 1 plus 822, so it's 300. I said this is going to be difficult. Yeah. Got rid of my X ton and uh, break these with one break these scale, so this is going to be difficult. It's pretty clearly and obvious that he's just going to have a ass ton of background. The duel's not going to go well. But hey, that's Yu Gi Oh! for you. Just ass ton of background. Welcome to Yu Gi Oh! You know? Mm. And you kill him. I, I have to kill him. It's just how am I gonna fucking play when my opponent has the fucking mountain of back row? I'm not. That, that's the answer. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. But hey, that, that's, that's one thing you can definitely do in Yu-Gi-Oh. Play back row and one-up your opponent. It even has a name for it. You know? In any other game, card game. You know? Fucking, uh... Duel Masters. You know, Hearthstone. Pokemon. There's not back row like this. It's just Yu-Gi-Oh that does it. It's weird. It really is weird. But hey, I guess I'm the dumb one for not playing back row. Right? Look, look at all this back row. Just a monster backed up by back row. This man is just putting his helmet on and dueling me. This might as well just be a Bujin Yamada right now, because this is exactly how this duel feels right now. Uh, you're 22, right? Yeah. Doesn't matter. <laughs> and he's literally just drawing cards because he keeps on killing my monster. And every single time I try to do something, he's just going to one-up me with background and rinse and repeat. So, 
Like I said, I'm going to try to go ahead and do these Doom Shaman plays, and as soon as I get hit with Batgirl, we'll just go ahead and scoop it up and get another dual one, because it's pretty obvious that nothing is going to... Not this isn't going to end well. It's pretty obvious. So... Activate. Okay. Doom Shaman. Mm. Like I said, you have fucking Batgirl with the ass, so... This, look at this, look at this. He's literally played one monster this entire duel back to back back row. Helmet, you know. Is my normal summon. Or should I just activate super vice? No, fuck it. Let's just go in. Let's just go in. Fuck it. Builds. Surprise a fat chain tinker. Chain result backwards. A tinker. Look at this card. Do I want an oasis? I kind of do. Oh, this is gone. This is gone. Uh. So I'll go ahead and go into Scrap Dragon. One more summon. Four. Alright. Alright. I'm going to Scrap Dragon. Like I said, I gotta clear up the background. It's pretty obvious. Like I gotta clear up the background. I can't even do anything until I'm just surprised if there's no background that's been chained yet. I mean, clearly there's going to be some D prisons back there. Tinker fact that it's mandatory. I had to look, even though it's the same fucking card. And we'll go ahead and scrap a fat. Target fields. And that. Well, I'm just going to clear up this back row. And eventually I'll clear it all up, so. Okay. You know, I don't even want to attack him or him, because... It's just going to be more back row, you know? If I attack him, then he searches, but if I don't attack him, then, you know, I'm just going to take the slow. Yeah. Summon some decent beaters. The only thing that I don't like about Sabres is, you know, they have level 1 tuners and shit, so it's stuck on level 4 and he has level 2, I'm going to get trashed, so. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So... You're level 4, you're level 4, he'll probably summon like maybe, so it's level 4 or lower, right? Does it have a level 4 or lower beast type tuner? I think they do, so I'm probably going to go ahead and get trished. Okay, no, he's going to go for Dark Soul, so that's fine. Face down? Yeah, it's face down. And go ahead and make see these two into one, at least I don't have to worry about this anymore. Oh, no, he does. Well, here we go. Here we go. Take take my take my little chain, a card that I love, and then bring back a card trick shoot a card I hate. Yep, here we go. Yep, here we go. I hate that card so much. I back when we thought it was gonna get unbanned and it didn't, you know, we were playing duels where it's just like, Oh yeah, let's go ahead and play as if it was here again and I got trished and I hated it. So, here we go. Yep. Back row plus Trish equals no, no, thank you. No, no, no. I hate Trish still, and I hate that my level chain is banned, and sometimes I hate Yu Gi Oh! But mainly because of this list. Like I said, I, I, I hate the July list. It's probably my most hated list. I even hate it more than fucking Snatch Dale coming back. At least that list didn't take anything away from me. So it literally took my fucking Lawala chain and gave everybody back Trish, which I hate because it, now it's just fucking up my fucking new bells and shit. Like, it just, this list literally just said, you know what? Fuck anybody playing anything uh, low tier. It's all about the high tier. And if you're not playing the high tier, then you get the dick. Fuck fun. Fuck fun. You gotta play meta people. You know? 
You want to go ahead and play your little, uh, nice little zombie deck? Nah, fuck that. Fuck that. You gotta play that meta. Because really, what, what are the decks that don't really, are unfazed by, you know, the wall of chain being hit? The meta decks. What are the decks that get hit? They're not a meta deck, so. Fuck fun. Fuck fun. Simple as that. Like, I don't give two shits about Clown Blade. I don't give two fucks. <sighs> Let me guess. Necros. Fucking 50 card fucking necro, 60 card fucking necros. Gonna trish me? So let me guess, I'm gonna get trished. Hmm. A BLS deck, okay. Let's say, I would be smart to go ahead and ram your Senju into my Armageddon Knight. Get rid of them both. Terrible ass him. Terrible. Drawing fucking tear when I don't fucking need him. Need it. Of course. And back row. Not that I'm playing any back row, but. I'm gonna summon you, Bell. It's pretty obvious. I got foolish. Nice. I gotta deal with fucking. Still gotta deal with BLSs, though, so. And that's just. That's just straight up just out of my hand. So, I didn't. You know, I hate summoning my fucking forms out of my hand. It's like, I, I can summon them out of my deck. Like, oh, thank God, I drew Foolish. Because probably would drew Doom Shaman, man. Fuck my life, so. Alright, so we got those two. Just need to tinker and we can get started. Then deal with all the back row. Now I'll just go battle phase and phase. Back. So what's this say? This card is tribute that you can add with BLS. Okay, so you just summoned this 19 beater. Go ahead. I say if you want to do a terror, we'll be summon BLS. Or BLS. Super BLS. Isn't that its name? The, the new ritual? Super BLS? BLS Super Soldier or something like that? I forgot its name. Uh, I gotta stall. I gotta stall until I get Tinker. Hmm, okay. Cree ball. The thing looks creepy. I, I don't know. It just looks really weird. It looks like you took, like, the sphere of raw and drew, like, eyes and fucking arms and legs on that shit. Like, what the fuck? Hmm. <laughs> I was thinking about MST and my opponent's already in the deck, so fuck it. These Gaia's, they're not doing anything. It's sent to the graveyard, plus on uh, you know, I see it wants to turn you through the uh, okay. I said, I want, uh, MST, it's just, mm, you know? I love MST. Uh, did you just wrote it? Did you just search for it? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I'm about to say. I mean, this game state is now irreparable because I'm not even sure if you fucking returned the curry ball. For all I know, you returned something else. But okay. So. It's good to know that even if I start getting sacked, I already won this duel. Okay, that's fine. Hmm, okay. Mm. 
you know what? I'm gonna start pushing. This duel is getting boring, and I wanna end this video anyway. How can I call the hunted? Okay. If you have the MST, then I guess I'm not gonna push, but I wanna start pushing. Heavy Storm is gone, so I gotta do a back row, and you know, I'm level with Katachi's thing, but seriously, are you ever gonna attack 5v battle on the field? Of course not, so like, you really can't use that card. It's just. The snuggles are real. The snuggles just make me wanna cry. I just. I, I, want, to, I want to play, but I can't. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and activate Silent Doom. Yeah, I gotta go through th three background. If something happens to Doom Shaman, then I'm fucked. Just like you. But hey, that's what happens when I'm running a non trid deck in a tier world of Yu-Gi-Oh. Here we go. There we go. So uh, pretty much, I can't do any plays anymore. So I might as well just scoop it up. I I can't play. I can't play. There we go. I can't play. I need my Doom Shaman. And it gets bottomless, that's it. Yeah, 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 I can't, yeah, I can't do any close to that dude phone. Yeah, I can't. Simple as that, I cannot do any place without Doom Shaman. It really sucks. I could run more than Doom Sh one Doom Shaman, but then I risk drawing it more than that good clog. Like I said, this is what happens when I try to run a non-tier deck in a tier world. No. 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 Only, only, only ultimate can attack. And it's pretty clear. anytime soon so no there's no point in me just sitting here I'm waiting for you fucking fuck me like no if you bottom list my doom shaman that's it it's simply how it goes you know you run a fucking 50 60 fucking card plus deck I get bottomless that's it you know number generator gives you bottomless I lose simple as that and as simple as that welcome to fucking Yu-Gi-Oh I don't want to see your fucking hand I don't care I'm glad I'm, you know, I'm so glad I take these fucking weekends off, it's just I can't. I might as well run two Doom Shaman, just I'm risk to draw, at least so if I get boundless, at least I won't lose, but, I don't know, I don't know what I'm doing, I don't know what I'm doing. I try so hard, and it's just I can't. So that other back row, even the deep prison wouldn't have bothered me, but the boundless, is just like, damn, you know, boundless is like my, this deck's ultimate weakness, ultimate weakness, and, yep. I'm just having a really hard time. I really am. Without the Wall of Chain. Wall of Chain ban. Trish back, which sucks. Then I gotta do a Necro Trish, that Trish. And I'm just slow. Much slower. You know, I used to be able to be like, oh yeah, special, send, you know, go on chain, send, get really set up. And maybe like the first two turns. Now it's just like, I hope he kills my Mystic Tomato by battle so I can send. Oh wow, I'm going so fast. I'm going fast like Sanic. I guess I'll run two Doom Shaman and then draw into one of them, and then it'll get stuck in my hand, and I won't have Dark Graffer, and my hand will be ass. But hey, that's what happens when you run a non tier deck in a tier world. And that BLS deck sucks too, so. Alright, so. I apologize, people. I apologize. I don't know what you want me to do. I, I want to continue Vitamin Y, but it's just so fucking hard to do it. Every single deck just seems like it's having a much harder time, and it's, you know, it's obvious that it's having a harder time. I'm trying to. Keep the consistency up by running Mr. Tomato, but it's just slow and shitty, and... Yeah. Alright, so I won nothing this video. 25 minutes of me just sitting here getting my ass beat the living shit of. But hey, that's what happens. <sighs> ah, slow as fuck. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I promised that I would bring you guys Vitamin Y during the weekdays, but it's pretty clear that I can't even do it with a fucking new belt deck. Unless I duel against someone who's absolute trash, I mean, they're gonna get one up by background and lose, or they're just gonna outpace me and I lose, and, like, what am I doing? Alright, so, of course, weekend's off, great, you know, 
I said, maybe, and this might be speaking blasphemy, but maybe Dexter just so reliant on, like, Lalala training getting set up, they might have to get taken off, you know? Like, I still have Evil Hero Yubel, and I really don't need Yubel, I mean, Lalala train for that one. And, uh, what else? I had, I had Umbra Yubel, but there's no way. Like, that deck, it's clearly a rank 4 deck, so the Lalala chain is just the tits in that deck, so there's no way. So that's not gonna work. Take off Supervise, let's see. Uh, or Trinity Bell can stay. Yeah, that's not really reliant on, uh, on the Bumble Chain at all. Doesn't even really need your bell, actually, but, yeah. Uh, Labradite. They kind of need the Bumble Chain, i tell you the truth, they really did. It really did. The setup is much slower. It's just like this deck, much slower without the Bumble Chain. Uh, Yubelk sees it kind of needed a little wobble chain. Like I said, set up much slower. Cosmic didn't. Cosmic didn't need a wobble chain, so that one's fine. And then this deck, which needed a wobble chain, so I could probably take off, uh, I could probably take this deck off and put, like, you know, Evil Hero Yubel, and I could try, I could put Red Eyes Yubel, because that does that kind of needed a wobble chain. It, it, it helped me set up. It was Nibbler in that deck, but. It wasn't as bad. I could still play without it. And, you know, I, I tried to make freaking, like, like, uh, Melodious Ubel, which is not really a Ubel deck at all. It's just Melodious Ubel in it. It sounds, like, terrible, but hey, at least it doesn't need the Law of Chain. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, people. So, taking the weekend off, of course. Thank God, so I don't fucking have to play Yu Gi Oh! on the weekends. Okay, I guess he's asking about League, but I haven't even got Stu's deck, so... And League, not since I'm bringing it up, League should start on uh, August 1st, so... Uh, you know, with Vimy Y being complete shit, because I can't play, hopefully League will be good. Like I said, hopefully the next list will bring back a little chain, and I can at least play Yubel. For now, I'll go ahead and add an extra Doom Shaman, so if case one gets bottomless, you know, at least with bottomless at one. At least I can only have to worry about being bottomless once. You know, Toronto, I don't care. If I'm morning, I don't care. But bottomless is just like, so. Maybe it's just best to run two Doom Shaman. Yeah. And like I said, without, with me not running my real life, you build that. And, you know, I have multiple Doom Shamans. I have super rares, ultimate rares, Doom, multiple Doom Shamans at the ass. People literally gave me Doom Shamans when they saw me, because, you know, you are mastery and, you know, Doom Shaman is like number two to you bell. You know, I just, I only have one miscut one, so. So, I pr if I remade my Ubel deck in real life, I wouldn't even play that one. I literally like keeping it in my wallet. So, yeah. Alright, I'm done, I'm done. <sighs> Alright, people, thanks for watching. Apologize, I, I really do.